Real Madrid stars following the Cristiano Ronaldo method for all-round improvement. Official, Real Madrid register Kylie and Bap in La Liga. The Endrick Formula in action, Real Madrid offer 25 million euros for the Pearl of Argentina. Real Madrid seeking a way out for forgotten 22-year-old attacking midfielder. Real Madrid stars following the Cristiano Ronaldo method for all-round improvement. Journalist Carlos Anangono has shared in as that Real Madrid players are currently adhering to what is called the Cristiano method. This approach involves adopting the former striker's philosophy of continuous self-improvement, maintaining professionalism in training, and being mindful of nutrition. Interestingly, these practices are still very much alive at Valdebebas today. It is said that Cristiano Ronaldo's legacy at Real Madrid extends from the starting players to the substitutes at the club. His mentality of always being there for the team and never giving up, regardless of playing time, is a guiding principle. Ronaldo remains the biggest influence at the club, even today, inspiring both the current stars and the emerging talents. Cristiano's ethics are valued at Real Madrid. Although over six years have passed since Ronaldo departed from Real Madrid, his presence is still deeply felt at the club. However, not everyone knows about his work ethic and lifestyle which continue to resonate in the Real Madrid dressing room. Since his arrival in 2009, Ronaldo's presence initiated a cultural shift within the club, extending beyond the sporting aspect. Today, players like Vinicius Jr., Rodrigo, Aurelian Chouamini, and Arda Güler grew up watching the Portuguese star excel in a Real Madrid jersey. And now, as they step into similar roles, they embody Ronaldo's legacy in their professional lives during their holidays. They particularly follow the Cristiano method to maintain their physical fitness for the upcoming preseason. Even Bap imitated Ronaldo from a professional viewpoint, Cristiano's footballing impact in Madrid is unparalleled. He has indeed been accused of his individualistic nature and the lack of team's collective spirit, but his success, along with that of the team, is historic. Therefore, Ronaldo's time at Madrid serves as a benchmark for the current generation of footballers who are now making their mark. Interestingly, his influence extends beyond Real Madrid. For instance, Kylie Mbappe replicated Ronaldo's iconic presentation at Real Madrid. During the press conference, Mbappe also highlighted the significant role Ronaldo has played in his career. Ronaldo's approach to football goes beyond just scoring goals and winning titles. His dedication to daily improvement, rigorous training routines, and strict nutritional habits have set a new standard at Real Madrid. These principles have been embraced by players throughout the squad, regardless of their status on the team. Official, Real Madrid register Kylie Mbappe in La Liga. After years of wait, Real Madrid finally secured their dream signing as Kylie Mbappe arrived on a free transfer this summer after his contract at PSG expired. Los Blancos announced the French superstars signing a couple of days after winning the UEFA Champions League in June. Upon completion of the UEFA Euro 2020 for earlier this month, Real Madrid officially presented Mbappe to the fans and media in front of a packed Santiago Bernabeu. Now, the Frenchman, who has signed a five-year contract until 2029 with the Spanish Capital Club, has officially been registered with La Liga. Indeed, with the registration now complete, Mbappe's name shows up on the La Liga official website's transfer page for this summer as well as the Real Madrid squad list page. As has already been confirmed, Bap will be wearing the No. 9 shirt at Real Madrid which has been vacant since last year following the departure of another French superstar in Karim Benzema. Considering the healthy financial situation that Los Marengs are in, there were never any problems likely to pop up as far as registration with La Liga is concerned despite the 25-year-old's high wages. With Bap's registration done, Real Madrid will now look to complete the process for their second new arrival of the summer in the form of Endrick. The Endrick formula in action, Real Madrid offer 25 million euros for the Pearl of Argentina. Journalist Sergio Lopez de Vicente has reported through us that Real Madrid are poised to make a significant offer for one of Argentina's brightest young talents, Franco Mastantuono. The club is preparing to present a bid of 25 million euros to River Plate for the 16-year-old attacking midfielder. 
Though Mastan Tuono's name has not been widely discussed in the media, negotiations with him and his current club are progressing smoothly. The quiet surrounding the deal is indicative of Real Madrid's preference for discretion in their transfer dealings. Real Madrid are being careful. Mastan Tuono's recent contract extension with River Plate has raised his release clause to 45 million euros, reflecting his high value in the market. Nevertheless, Real Madrid are working diligently to finalize the transfer at a lower cost, targeting a final figure of around 25 million euros. It must be noted that Real Madrid's pursuit of Mastan Tuono has evolved through several stages. Initially, there was clear interest, followed by a period of internal deliberation, and now the club has resolved to move forward with the acquisition. This determination is largely driven by Santiago Solari, the current director of football, who has been a strong advocate for signing Mastan Tuono. Solari's insistence on pursuing the young talent has placed him in charge of managing the negotiations. He has been in regular contact with River Plate and Mastan Tuono's representatives, fostering a positive relationship that is expected to facilitate the deal. Real Madrid plan to use the Endrick formula. The negotiations are progressing with a favorable outlook, and there is optimism that the final transfer fee will be less than the 45 million euros release clause. Meanwhile, Real Madrid are also considering a strategy similar to their previous deal for Endrick, where the player could be signed now but remain with his current club for an additional year. This approach would allow Mastan Tuono to continue his development at River Plate and arrive at Real Madrid in a more mature state, potentially easing the current squad's congestion issues. Although no agreement has been finalized and no immediate conclusion is expected, Real Madrid are actively working towards securing this exceptional young talent. Real Madrid seeking a way out for forgotten 22-year-old attacking midfielder. Journalist Pepe Gilvernet has reported through Mundo Deportivo that Rainier Jesus is becoming a subject of sheer headache for Real Madrid. As a result of this, the outlet has suggested that Madrid are now seeking a way out for the young player, either through a transfer or a loan. It must be noted that Real Madrid paid 30 million euros for Rowanier, believing he was one of the most promising talents of his generation. However, almost five years and several loans later, that investment has not paid off as expected. Recently, the former Flamengo player was not included in Carlo Ancelotti's squad for the preseason tour of the United States. Instead, the club is actively seeking options for his departure, as he is not part of their current or future plans, Rainier is under Rawls' wings. The aforementioned outlet says that Rainier is currently training under Rawl at Costilla and even scored a hat-trick in a friendly match against the Lescas, but this performance did little to change his situation. The reason why Real Madrid and Carlo Ancelotti are not counting on him is because his loan spales have been largely unsuccessful. During his time at Borussia Dortmund, he struggled to find playing time, accumulating only 745 minutes over the seasons. This lack of opportunities eroded his confidence and hindered his development, despite Dortmund's reputation for nurturing young talent. After returning to Spain, Rainier failed to make a significant impact at Girona during the 20-23 season. He started well under Mitchell but was soon sidelined by a series of physical problems, limiting him to just 18 games and to goals. His loan to Frosinone in Syria was slightly better, with him recording 23 games, 3 goals and 2 assists. However, he returned to Real Madrid with little fanfare. Real Madrid exploring avenues for Rainier. As a result, Real Madrid are now exploring another opportunity for Rainier, possibly considering a transfer where they retain 50% of his rights. The case of Rainier is a reminder that not all investments in young talent yield positive results. Other notable failed transfers include Luka Jovic, who cost 60 million euros, Lucas Silva for 15 million euros, and William Jose. These examples show that even a club with Real Madrid's resources and expertise can sometimes miss the mark in the highly unpredictable market of emerging footballers.